Hey, how's it going? This is Steve. I just wanted to talk for a minute about this ongoing conversation about guns on the set and props in the movies. The different props that we use are always, you know, somewhat just replicas or models. They're, n they're never real. But people might ask sometimes, okay, if you're not going to have real props on the set, then how are you going to have, you know, any, anything that looks real as far as, uh, 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 like confrontations or gunplay or that kind of thing. How are you going to do that? So I'm going to show you how we do that. I mean, there's several ways you can do it. You know, you can have you can have live rounds on the set, which is the whole part of the conversation that we're trying to talk about. We don't want to do that because of the of the danger. And then you can have uh, stock footage. Uh, you know, actual gun bursts that you can purchase. You know, whether they're alpha channels or whatever, and you can modify them yourselves, or or you can actually paint them on yourselves with uh, some of the editing tools. And another option is to uh, have some of these editing tools that will allow you to to use plugins that will allow you to add the you know, pyrotechnic type of things, including gun bursts. So there's there's uh, many ways to do it, but what I'm going to do here today is uh, show one of the different ways that that we can do it as far as adding, you know. Uh, muzzle flash is what we're looking for you know as long as we can add muzzle flash that's effective and then we're ready to go so I'm going to start with for instance get this gun right here you know it's just, just a regular handgun obviously a BB gun it's it's uh, basically shoots these little plastic BBs so I'm checking a monitor over here, so that's why you keep seeing me look this way. So this thing takes BBs, there's none in there. But yeah, anyway, I can make it do this. So the main thing is to figure out how, you know, how you're going to make it move. Because usually the gun will have two different movements. It's going to go... You know, whenever you expend a round, it's going to go this way, back and forth. Not to mention, it's going to go this way, up and down. So you got to find the right balance to make it look look real. So, <coughs> okay, enough with that one. Now, this one's already been painted. It looks real. It's all also BB gun. To the old yellow BBs right there. But check this out. I don't even need to cock it. If you go and do your thing, just got a plastic hammer. <laughs> but you go and do your thing and bam. So once again, you'll go this way and you'll go this way while you're pulling the trigger. So, what's next? You can also go with automatic weapons. So there's this configuration here, once again. BB gun. No rounds in there, but BB gun. And this one just... Okay, so you get the point. And I have a specialty weapon for you. What have we here? Oh, what have we here? Now, a lot of you are familiar with these things. And in my opinion, making these things glow is one of the holy grails of motion picture special effects for hand weapons. All right, let's see what this thing can do. 